Hi guys, welcome back. And uh, today, I'm going to be showing you the fleet of my British steam engines. So, this video is for, uh, yeah, like I said, my British steam engines is what I have so far. Uh, I am going to go in order from my first ever British steam locomotive to the latest one that I have. So, um, yeah, let's get started. So here is my first ever British steam locomotive I've ever got. Excuse me, this one is Mallory, and this one is very special to me. Uh, this locomotive holds a really special place in my heart, even the real thing, because uh, well, obviously, if you, everyone can know, it's the world's fastest steam locomotive. So, yeah, there's the beautiful Hornby Railroad A4 Mallard. So this one is uh, another really great model. This one is, uh, now we're going to Bachman Branch Line. Uh, so this model is the uh, Silver Fox. Feels like it's an early 2000s model, but uh, it's still a nice runner, even though the shape is slightly incorrect. But um, hey, it's close enough to me. So yeah, there's Silver Fox. Uh, I, got, I actually got her for Christmas last year. Christmas of 2017, not uh, 2018. There she is. Now we come to my third British locomotive, and not to mention the biggest one that I own by far. <laughs> this thing is absolutely huge. This is the uh, Gresley P2. Uh, it's uh, this this thing is absolutely awesome. It is one of my favorites. I love running this thing a, a whole lot because uh, it yeah, it's, it's just it just looks so nice. Um, yeah, the P2. All six members were, were really sadly rebuilt and scrapped by our fiend Edward Thompson. <laughs> yeah, but hey, don't worry. I did hear a new one is being built. And uh, that will be the seventh member of the class, and it will be named Prince of Wales. So, there's that. So awesome to be having another P2 running on the main line really soon. So, yeah. Now we're going back to the 1980s. Um, this is my uh, fourth one in my collection. This is Sir Nigel Gresley. I actually just got done servicing this locomotive uh, not too long ago. Uh, but yeah, this one is a really nice runner. Even though it's missing the handrails and the whistle and that coupling hook at the tender. But uh, hey, other than that, it's still a really nice model. Uh, I am thinking about replacing the body. Uh, if I can, with uh, details, with more details on it, so I probably will, so I wouldn't have to um, make new details for it. And making new detail for locomotives is not easy to do, especially if they're in this scale. So yeah, um, there's my fourth model in my British fleet. Oh look, we have yet another A4. <laughs> yeah, I'm a huge sucker for those things. Uh, yeah. This is my uh, British Railways uh, Golden Plover. This is the Lake Crest one. And uh, this one still runs pretty good. Even though what drives me crazy the most is um, this little gear right here, if you can see it. That one always likes to snap off sometimes, but um, hey, ever since I modified my layout, it rarely happens anymore, so, yeah. 
it's only held on by a little plastic hook and uh, if there's a way for me to fix that I would so happily do it but uh, yeah there's a golden plover I do hope to get another A4 in uh, this livery it looks so awesome Oh, did I mention there's another A4? <laughs> uh, yeah, this one is a Commonwealth of Australia. It's a limited edition one. And uh, yes, I know you've noticed the um, lamp iron broken off. Stupid me decided to try and brush off the dust with my finger. And I didn't realize it until this lamp iron broke off. If I can find a replacement, I would be happy, but I know it's not going to be easy. So, yeah. And the little doors in the cab were missing too when I was getting this thing repaired. Uh, there it is, you can just see it there. So yeah. Even though this one is, um, feels like it's got a curse on it, but uh, hey, it, all I can say, it still runs awesome. It still runs amazingly. So yeah, there's the Commonwealth of Australia. Did I mention it's also uh, a thousandth unit of 1500 units? So, yeah. I bet you guys thought another one was going to be an A4. <laughs> Not this time. You're now getting a break from it. Thank God. <laughs> um, I bet that's what you're all saying right now, huh? <laughs> but yeah, let me get this in focus. There we go. Sorry for the shaky camera there. Um, yeah, this is my latest one. This is the Hornby Railroad Tornado. This one is a really good runner. Uh, I really do like this one a lot. So, yeah, <laughs> there's Tornado. I do run this thing pretty much a lot more. Uh, but, yeah. I can't figure out what else to say because um, this model is, uh, is, is really, really good. And uh, if you don't have one, you need to get one of these because uh, this th this thing is awesome. <laughs> it's it's really awesome. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching my fleet of British steam engines that I have so far, and uh, I will see you guys later in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.